Hi, Jason Franchuk here at the Marriott Center Wednesday night. BYU pulls out a hard-earned 77-73 win against UNLV to open conference play. Not exactly like you might have thought going into this game. If I tell you BYU's best shooter, best scorer coming in, Jimmer Fredette is 2 of 10 from the field, you probably think the Cougars were in trouble. They were, but they had teammates who bailed them out. Noah Hartsock put up a big-time game, 17 points. His backup, Jonathan Tavernari, showed that senior experience off the bench. He also had 17, and BYU wins its conference opener. BYU improves to 15-1. and one. They're on a 10-game winning streak right now. Big guy of the game also, Michael Lloyd. Seven points in 16 minutes for the Cougars. He came in in the final four minutes after Fredette was pulled. He had a turnover. Media timeout came, and Lloyd came right in, got a couple layups. Jonathan Tavernari had a three-pointer, and BYU erased that five-point deficit they had going into the final five minutes. Then it was 69-66. The Cougars trailed with 356 left. You look at all the ailments BYU had. Fredette that's been battling strep and weight loss. He was also sporting a long sleeve t-shirt because Dave, Coach Dave Rose said he had an allergic reaction to some medicine. Jackson Emery with that bruised heel, hadn't played in eight days. He was on the floor, hit a crucial shot with 25 seconds left. And then Noah Hartsock also had his nose busted early in the first half and then backup point guard Lamont Morgan Jr. was out of the game in the first half when he ran into a screen and had a concussion. Not exactly the way the Cougars drew this up, but you don't win three consecutive conference titles without figuring out a way or two to win along the way. Tonight what we were able to do was overcome uh, the fact that our guards didn't shoot the ball very well. Uh, Noah, JT, Brandon, Chris Miles, those guys played really well offensively and then Mike Lloyd and Charles came in and helped us. And so, I mean, it's a team, and uh, sometimes you just got to figure out a way to win, and tonight they did. BYU shot worse than 30% in the first half, but still managed to lead by one point, 33-32 at halftime. Shot a more Cougar-like 51% in the second half. Again, Noah Hartsock, 17 points. Jonathan Tavernari, 17 points. UNLV only had one double-digit score. Trayvon Willis had 24, but the Cougars get away with this one. Now they get a brief break from conference play. They'll go to Old Western Athletic Conference rival UTEP on Saturday before heading out to Air Force next Wednesday. I'm Jason Franchuk. Thanks for tuning in.